Good morning and welcome to Wake Up and Make Up. My name is Jennifer Wilsey. We're going to do a makeup tutorial today because we got to get ready. we got to get up, get dressed, and get ready to go, right? So we're going to just attack this day. <clears throat> I hope that you all are having a fabulous day and living your best life. Okay, these things are not wanting to stick in place. That's okay. We already did the morning skincare regimen. Vitamin C for brightening. <clears throat> I don't know why my throat needs to be clear today. Belief Aqua Balm to add that extra moisture and help fill in those lines and wrinkles. And then depuff those under eyes because I don't know why. I'm just, <clears throat> I need more. Um, I need to sleep more. I think, I think that's it. Um, Belief VDL <clears throat> Aqua Bomb. <clears throat> We're going to put this on as a primer. It's also going to add some added moisture, but it's going to give us that glow. There we go. We'll just pat it in. It's going to give us that prime, but it's also going to give us that glow. So it's going to be a two in one. Yes. All right. <clears throat> cashmere complexion and buttercream gonna put that on the face and I was looking yesterday I was wondering why um, it was kind of drying on my hand quicker than I was getting it on my face and I think it's more um, because it's a quick drying foundation and so if I'm going in with it directly on my face, I was wondering if it will spread even more evenly. So we're gonna try that out today. Give it a little bit of a of a try and see if we see a difference. You know what? I didn't wet this and so it feels like it's hard as a rock going on my face I need to wet it because it's not gonna it's not going to blend as well and it feels like I'm beating my face with a rock not into that today okay yeah definitely blends well just putting it directly on yay okay we are all blended up. Let's go in now with some Cashmere Complexion and Matcha for our concealer. So to conceal those under eyes. Put just a little bit on the eyelid to help cover up, um, well, to conceal. It also is a good primer for your eyeshadow is using your concealer because it makes your whole eyelid match that under eye area and it blends well. There we go. So much better. I can see such a difference. Can you? Yay! Okay, all blended. Let's do some brows, Tattoo Station Brow Liner. First, I'm going to spindle up these brows and get them set in place. Things just aren't working my way today, that's okay. And then go in and fill them puppies in. Giving them life. Helping them frame out my face. Yes, yes, yes. So much difference. You can see such a difference from this eye to this eye. Just from doing that little bit of extra work. And it's really, if you have the right brow liner, it's really not a lot of work. It's just the motions. Swapping motions. There we go. Just blending those in. I gotta get the lid. Hold on. 
<clears throat> okay. Brows are done. Let's add some Magic's Dust and set this look. And then we will add in a little bit of eyeshadow. So, it's a new week. So, do you have new plans for the week? Um, some kids are starting to go back to school. We have made the decision we're going to homeschool this first few weeks um, and just see how things go, especially with our boys and their health. We had to make the right decision, so it's okay. That's what we're doing. All right. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, let's do um, eyeshadow quad in chocolate sensation and pick up a little bit of that lighter color first, that one, and just do the lid of our eyes. Just doing it gently, kind of patting it on, not putting a ton of color. So I'm not going anywhere today. So we're just going to do a light eye look. We don't have to be extremely bold. Okay. Good deal. All right. Let's do two with our blending brush. And. You could really just use one and two with this eye look and still get a great eye look. And just pull it on that crease and then pull it down and kind of be a, a two-toned eye look instead of a three or four or five or however ever many. I'm just pulling that down on the lid There we go. Blend, blend, blend. If there is any advice on eyeshadow, it is blend, blend, blend. Blending is your best friend. Okay, looks good to me. Let's do a super extend liquid liner and line these eyes out. There we go. Just a lot line. It doesn't have to be tremendous. Um, just to give you a little bit of definition. Okay. All right, let's curl our lashes and we'll add just a little bit of Love Mascara. I've got to find it first. That's a good thing. <laughs> We're going to do Love Waterproof and waterproof those eyes. Urgh! So I think I figured out a trick on how to make your lips more full. So I'm going to try that today and we'll see if it works. I've been watching some different YouTube videos and seeing kind of some of the tips and tricks that they they do to make things work differently and I thought, hmm. That's definitely something we could try. You know, like those lips um, that they add the collagen and stuff to. We could have some super plump Kim Kardashian lips if that's your goal. <laughs> 
All right, Queen Carnation in blush. Just gonna add a little bit of pink to those cheeks. And ah, there we go. Just give them a little plump. I put up a blush chart yesterday on my Facebook page that showed like different face shapes and how you should wear your blush. I thought it was pretty interesting. Okay, <clears throat> all right, let's do, let's line these lips. So the tutorial I watched said if you will go right on your lip, lip line, just above it, just a little bit. I'm using um, my two-in-one lip tattoo. It has the liner side. There we go. Um, what shade am I in? Inked Rose. And pull it in just a little bit on those lips. So I went above the natural line of my lip. And then I pulled it in just a little bit on my lip. Okay, let's add surprise and birthday balm and let's see. If it gives us fuller lips what do you think I do think they look a little bit fuller I'm not sure that they look like Kim Kardashian juicy but they look a little bit fuller what do you think <laughs> so I hope this make makeup tutorial was helpful for you this morning um, if you want any more tips um, feel free to reach out. I would love to help you share this video. Somebody else may need these tips. Good morning, Rebecca. I hope you have a great day um, and share because you never know who may else want some, may want some makeup tips. So have a great one and we will see you guys later. Bye-bye.